I'm gonna say a sentence, then I will say one word from that sentence, and all you have to do is type that word. Easy, right? I say a sentence, then you type one word from that sentence, and you win. Do you need an explanation or are you gonna follow me? Yes, your honor. <laughs> it is a spelling bee, correct. I'm gonna say a sentence and you're gonna give me the word. I'm not your honor. Lucas, nice to meet your teacher, fine with me. I hope you're doing well too. <laughs> you got it? Good. Um, there is something to this challenge, but you will find out. I don't, I don't know, you will see. There is something weird here and there. You're gonna find out. You're gonna find out. Mm. If you're ready, put the I'm ready sticker down below. So I know that Spongebob and Patrick are ready to do this challenge. Spongebob, Patrick, come on. Where are you at? There you go. There you go. All right, welcome to challenge number two, spelling bee. Uh, that's it guys, that's it, it's a spelling bee. Not that complicated. I say a sentence, then I say the word, you type the word. You can guess at any time, you can guess what word it is, but if you type the wrong word, then you're gonna be very late. If you're lucky, you'll be number one. Here we go. The cat drove a car to the supermarket. Drove. Please type the word drove. I hope you instantly see what's going on with this challenge. But if you don't, I'm not going to tell you. Ha 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 You will just have to find out. Alright, the cat drove a car to the supermarket. Drove. Just type it down below, top 10, I say your name. Because number one, Sunshine, well done. Sky Sky, Meilin, Tao, Jay, Philin, Meta, Sammy, and Lottis, Mario in the top 10. Amanda, Peach, Farida, Dan. So close to the top 10. Here is the next one. Cats don't drive? I don't know what, you, what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. All right. My coffee jumped out of the cup and started dancing on the table. Danced. And danced on the table. Danced. My coffee jumped out of the cup and danced on the table. Danced. <laughs> All you have to do is type the word. It's a very straightforward challenge. I'm sure you got it. We believe in you. You gotta listen to it, guys. I didn't say dance. I said danced. Danced. The coffee jumped out of past tense. Danced. I did not say dance. <laughs> Clean your ear. <laughs> well done. Peach, Jay, Adeline, Farida, Call Me Mike, Maylin, Elizabeth, Philin, Afeda. And Lotus in the top 10. Mario, Annie, Amanda, so close to the top 10. Your coffee, your coffee doesn't do that? Strange. Strange. Anyway, nothing weird going on. Let's go to the next sentence. Yesterday, I forgot to remember to forget. Forget. Yesterday, I forgot to remember to forget. Forget. Type the word forget. <laughs> I 
It's a, it's a good English sentence. Grammatically perfectly fine. Yesterday, I forgot to remember to forget. Forget. How to study to remember vocabulary? Welcome to one of the best challenges to remember vocabulary. Put it in a sentence. Well done, forget, F-O-R-G-E-T, Karen making it to number one, Dida, Sunshine, Chi, Tao, Amanda, Peach, Rania, Farida, Malin, in the top ten, Kettery, Jay, and Fabi, David, so close, <laughs> so close. All right, let's move on to the next one, which is going to be uh, great. Don't worry about it, guys. <sighs> Nothing weird going on. Nothing weird is going on. It's totally normal English challenge. <gasps> Despite having no hands or artistic ability, the moon meticulously baked a cake adorned with stars for the sun's annual celestial birthday celebration. Annual. Annual. Any questions? Any any questions? Normal challenge, right? Want me to say it one more time? Despite having no hands or artistic ability, the moon meticulously baked a cake adorned with stars for the sun's annual celestial birthday celebration. Annual. It's normal. What? There's nothing wrong with the sentence. The moon meticulously baked a cake adorned with stars for the sun's annual celestial birthday celebration. Good English sentence. Well done, Peach, making it to number one. Dina, Sky Sky, Tao, Jay, Elizabeth, Pearl, Denar, Villain, Shake Shake, Mario in the top 10, Raro, Trinity, Sunshine. Also well done. All right, here's the next one. It's just a spelling bee, guys. Type the word. The tree decided to walk to the beach. Beach. Type the word beach. Oh no, Ayina! The spelling mistake! No! Ah, good English sentences. Grammatically, they work well. The tree decided to walk to the beach. Well done. Beach, B-E-A-C-H. Chi, Peach, Sky Sky, Mercy, Annie, Amanda, Gaza, Karen, Roro, and Jay in the top 10. Elizabeth, Ha, Feelin, Shake Shake. So close. You have no connection, finger in the air. Use it as an antenna. Come on, you got this. Why you never mention your name? Top 10, if you are in the top 10, I will say your name. Here we go. My shoes are reading a novel about penguins. Novel. Novel. My shoes are reading a novel about penguins. Sounds like a normal English sentence to me. Sounds good to me. Right? I can speak English. I can speak Chinese. I should say duckies are reading a novel about penguins because you guys like penguins so much, right, YouTube gang? Well done, Chi making it to number one. Dida, Sunshine, Mario, Tao, Peach, 
Kettery, Dan, Trinity, and Danar in the top 10. Shake, shake, rock, rock, madam, Rayleigh. Also, well done to you. Any questions so far? Good challenge, right? Here's the next one. Here's the next one. All right, one word, no spacing. The fish flew across the sky with a suitcase. 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 The fish flew across the sky with a suitcase. Good English. Good grammar. Past tense flew. Well done. Suitcase is of course S-U-I-T-C-A-S-E. Peach, Sky Sky, Mario, Elizabeth, Sunshine, Denar, Shake Shake, Meta, Aiken, Chi in the top 10. Well done to you. Ni hao to you too. All right. This next one, a little bit more difficult. I know you can handle it. I know you can handle it. As midnight struck, the clock inexplicably began to sing a melancholic lullaby, echoing through the empty room as if trying to lull itself to sleep. Through. Through. Just a good English sentence. Double commas in a sentence. It's a long sentence, but good sentence. Through the empty room, echoing through the empty room. Which through is it, guys? As midnight struck, the clock inexplicably began to sing a melancholic lullaby, echoing through the empty room as if trying to lull itself to sleep. Lull, L-U-L-L. -L -L. Nice English word, lull itself to sleep, like singing a lullaby to yourself, lull, lulling, lull. <laughs> but you need to try type through, which is of course, th, 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 Well done to Peach again at number one, J, Fabi, Dinar, Villain, Shake Shake, Sky Sky, Libu, Annie, Chi in the top ten. Kettery, Trinity, Dita, and Pearl. So close. Top 10s, let's go. All right. We are getting there. You are doing well. And here is the next sentence. The elephant painted the fence with invisible paint. Fence. Fence. The elephant painted the fence with invisible paint. Fence. Like a, a fence in front of a house. How to type fence? Yes, I can speak Chinese. No, I'm not gonna do it. Fence. That's a nice painting. It must be a nice color. It must be a nice color. The elephant painted the fence with invisible paint. Fence is of course F-E-N-C-E. -E. Well done, Chi. Number one, Peach, J, Mario, Fabi, Trinity, Sunshine, Evita, Malin, Kettery in the top 10. Dida, Agnes, the Nar. Also well done too. You. Also well done to you. <laughs> All right. Here's the next sentence. Type the word. The clouds played chess with the mountains. Clouds. 
The clouds played chess with mountains. Clouds. Favorite place in China? I don't know. I like Xi'an. Xi'an was very nice. Anybody ever goes to China, go to Xi'an. It has the old wall. Very nice. Clouds. Hmm. Plural. Knew I would get you. I knew I would get you. <laughs> Shanghai is my favorite city. It has a lot of beautiful parks inside the city. It feels very good to be there. People are not so nice though, so uh, Xi'an. Well done on cloud. C L O U D S. Chi, Peach, J, Dira, Ha, Fort, Vic, Mario, Amanda, and Rania in the top 10. Trinity, Sunshine, Feeling, Rayleigh. So close to the top 10. Oh, you are doing well. Very, very well. Only about five more. So I'm sure you got this. I'm sure you got this. Here we go. No need to spam in my chat. Thank you. My socks are on vacation in Hawaii. Vacation. My socks are on vacation in Hawaii. Vacation. I'm not an American. From the Netherlands. Hollerin. My socks are on vacation in Hawaii. How to type? Not vocation, vacation. Vocation is a job, guys. The socks are on vacation. In Hawaii. <laughs> a normal English sentence, right? Well done, Mario, making it to number one. Dida, Yuan, Sunshine, Ford, Peach, Kateri, J, Ha, Meta in the top 10. Just Celia, MF, Allen, and Adeline. So close. Well done to you. Hawaii also with double I at the end. Alrighty. Alrighty. You are doing fantastic, guys. The next one is going to be difficult for me. I don't know if it's going to be difficult for you. It's going to be difficult for me. <sighs> Here we go. Here we go. Lucas, you got this. Lucas, I believe in you. The snow feeling mischievous laughed at the rain's inability to freeze and transformed into a peculiar shade of purple that perplexed the weatherman. Perplexed. Perplexed. The snow feeling mischievous laughed at the rain's inability to freeze and transformed into a peculiar shade of purple that perplexed the weatherman. Perplexed. A lot of things going on in this sentence. A lot of things going on in this sentence. <laughs> the snow feeling mischievous laughed at the rain's inability to freeze and transformed into a peculiar shade of purple that perplexed the weatherman. Purple snow. Nice. Purple snow. A peculiar shade of purple snow. Well done on perplexed! Bam, bam what? Why are you here with your 10th account? Welcome to number one. Avida, Peach, Trinity, Dida, Mario, Amanda, Jay, K Kai, and Mike. Well done to you. Maylin, Dan, Pearl, Akin, Ren. So close. I am perplexed. Bam Bam made it to number one on his 10th account. Well, if you were perplexed by this sentence, the next sentence is not going to make you feel any better. All right, here's another one. Here we go. 
The refrigerator, usually so stoic, developed an irrational fear of the microwave's beeping, believing it to be a countdown to an inevitable explosion. Inevitable. <laughs> What what a life, what a life. The refrigerator, usually so stoic, developed an irrational fear of the microwave's beeping, believing it to be a countdown to an inevitable explosion. Inevitable. Inevitable means it's going to happen at some point. Typos are inevitable, yes. <laughs> Typos are definitely inevitable. Um, stoic, guys, stoic, many of you wrote stoic, which just means very uh, straight-faced. Not a lot of emotions, but also very strong. Stoic. Thanos? Thanos is quite stoic, yes. He just does because he does. Um, the re refrigerator feeling so stoic... Usually so stoic, developed an irrational fear of the microwave's bleeping, believing it to be a countdown of an inevitable explosion. <gasps> inevitable. Well done to you. Inevitable. Inevitable. That's the word you need to type. Kettery, J, Bam, Peach, Trinity, Mario, Amanda, Dan, Shake Shake, Rock Rock, and Sky Sky in the top 10. Mike, Nettie, Sammy, Dida. So close to the top 10. It's inevitable that you are going to learn English if you just stick around. Well done to you. We only have three more and the last three sentences are shorter. Lucky for me. My pencil fell asleep while writing an essay. Essay. It was not essay! Not that essay. Different essay. My pencil fell asleep while writing an essay. Blame your pencil. Yes. Well done, O. You are correct. Writing an essay is not easy. Your pen is lazy? <laughs> Are you sure it's your pen? Who is lazy? Are you sure? Type the word. Type the word I'm telling you. That's how the game works. My pencil fell asleep while writing an essay. Essay. Well done. S A S A. E S S A Y. Type it down below. You still get the point. Chi, Wayina, J, Trinity, Meta, Sammy, Bam, Mario, Peach, and Kateri in the top 10. K, Rally, Vic. Well done to you too. Essay. You got it. You got it. Well done typing. S A E S S A Y. The next word, I'm sure you can type it. I believe in you. The bananas are arguing with the apples over politics. Arguing. Arguing. The bananas are arguing with the apples over politics. Arguing. You want to see the books? Well, there are many books. These books are about politics, economics, business. There are some story books, money, uh, philosophy, psychology. That's about it. I don't read political books. Too lazy. Don't care. That's the truth. I just don't care. But in this case, the bananas are arguing with the apples over politics. Arguing. Well, argue as a U-E because of the I-N-G. The E goes bye-bye. 
arguing. So it becomes A-R-G-U-I-N-G. -G. Well done, Chi! Back at number one. Mario, Meta, Pearl in the top 10, Sunshine, Vic, Peach, Dinar, Blue, Avida, and well done to you. Spectator, uh, Bara, and Maylin. So close to the top 10. Fruit government, better than a lizard government, if you know what I mean. Alrighty. The toaster swam in the pool last night. Bad idea. Toaster. Toaster. The toaster swam in the pool last night. I hope nobody swam with him. Uh, bad idea. <laughs> What a wild toaster, true story, true story. How to write, toaster. Well done, T-O-A-S-T-E-R, toaster. Well done, Mario, Chi, Dida, Rayleigh, Adeline, Amanda, Peach, Wayna, Maylin, Trinity, Top 10, Amanda, Bam, Alban, Kettery, Jay, Luvi, Cat, Rosaria, Dinar, and Shake Shake, Top 20. And everybody guessing words. Well done to you.